Welcome to ESC TV. I am Valentina Kutyfa, and I have Tom the Potter with me, representing the ERA Young Electrophysiologist community. Tom, can you please explain the mission of the Young Electrophysiologists and the need for a separate community within the ERA? So, the mission of ERA Young EP is to enhance, accelerate and facilitate the development of early career EPs. We've been fortunate that this need has been recognized by the ERA board. EP is a young field in general and it means the age distribution is asymmetric. For a young EP fresh out of training, there's a lot of opportunities to receive help. Think of it as, as if you will, as a shortcut to realize their potential as fast as possible. So what are the major needs and challenges of young electrophysiologists? Based on the feedback we got from our target group, and we've built a database of 500 people now, the main challenges for young EPs are further education, building a professional network and building a career. With this network that we've built for ourselves, we've been able to easily exchange information with our peers and also integrate this network with existing networks. For example, for scientific development, many of us are doing highly interesting work, but don't necessarily have the interpersonal network to come forward with their work at meetings such as this one. A group like ERA Young EP aims to lower that barrier to entry. For example, we organize clinical and research sessions at the past cardio stim meeting and we're building a database of young EPs that are motivated to participate in future meetings. So do you think it is relevant and important to promote research and innovation among young EPs? I, I, I really think innovation is crucial. If you think about it, the most likely group to foster innovation is, is our group, is the young people, which is why we were fortunate enough to be in close collaboration with other ERA initiatives, such as the Scientific Committee or the Innovations Committee. That sounds wonderful, Tom. So if I am a young EP, what do I need to do today to join the young EP community? That one is easy. For us to find you, we need to know about you. And for this purpose, we've been building a database of young EPs throughout Europe. Joining us is as easy as going to the Young EP website on ES Cardio under ERA and registering for free. And alternatively, you'll find a list of national ambassadors on this website, people in every single country that can help you join us and give you information about our activities. Thank you so much. And thank you for joining us for this interview. It was Valentina Kutifa and Tom De Potter from the Area Young EP community. Please check out our website and join us today.